A fun beach tip turned deadly. A Sefner man died after being struck by lightning on Sunday. News Channel 8's John Rogers has all the details. Good evening. Officials tell me this man was at the southern end of Siesta Beach when he was struck and killed. He wasn't near a lifeguard stand, but officials say that this is a sad reminder that you got to be really careful when you come out here to the beach. It all happened in a flash. Just after 2 p.m. on Sunday, 33-year-old James Barton was at Siesta Beach with friends when suddenly he was struck by lightning and killed. You couldn't ask for a better kid. I'm so proud of him. <laughs> I'm sorry. His mother, Talina Goad, says Jamie was beloved by many and lived for adventure. And his girlfriend was planning to move down here next month. He uh, had everything ahead of him. He said he's buying, he was fixing to buy a house. But sadly, he won't get that chance. Lifeguards gave warnings of Sunday's lightning, but Barton likely didn't hear it. The ample warning was given on the public beach. This patron was one mile south of the public beach, so there was no warning there as far as I know. Lifeguards and use these sky the scan devices to detect lightning miles nearby. Miles. They also constantly check the weather reports. When lightning comes too close, they blast horns and urge everyone to leave the beach. They're unprotected. There's nothing over their head. They're just out on flat ground, and there are no structures around. Goad urges others to be aware because you never know when your time is up. But I know he's right with God, and I know where he's at. That's what gives me hope. Officials say it's better just to play it safe. If weather conditions are worsening, get off the beach. On Siesta Beach, John Rogers, News Channel 8. Yesterday's deadly lightning strike in Sarasota is yet another reminder of how dangerous lightning can be. It turns out this week is actually Lightning Safety Awareness Week. Emergency officials say if you hear thunder, you are within striking distance of lightning and you should seek shelter immediately. Also, stay indoors for 30 minutes after you hear the last clap of thunder.